number 66. What happens to the delta G? Does it become more positive or more negative for the following chemical reactions when the partial pressure of oxygen is increased? And now we have a balanced equation. We have 2 SO2 gas plus O2 gas yields 2 SO3 gas. Okay, so they did tell us that the partial pressure of oxygen is increased. So here's my oxygen, O2. So I know that the pressure of O2, whenever they say partial pressure, that just means that it's a pressure of one single component. So the pressure of O2 is going to increase. But now what's going to happen to the delta G? Is it going to become more positive or more negative? Well, this all comes back to the Chatelier's principle, right? Whether you increase your amount of something, in this case, we're just dealing with pressures, but if you increase an amount of something, equilibrium has to shift to get you back to where you were. So if you increase your amount of something, in this case, that's what exactly we did, right? The pressure of oxygen increased, you have too much of it. So you have to make a change. And whenever you have too much of it, your equilibrium will shift to the opposite side. Meaning, since the increase was on your reactant side, you're going to shift to the opposite side. You're going to go to the opposite side. So because my increase was on the reactants, I know that I can make more product. So my shift is going to be to the right. And it kind of makes sense. If you have more of this, you can make more product. But now what does this direction mean in terms of a delta G being more positive or more negative? Well, this comes back to being spontaneous or non-spontaneous. A spontaneous reaction means that you are going to your products without any additional help. And that's exactly what this is doing. Since it's already shifting to the products, it doesn't need any extra help. So this reaction is spontaneous. And always know that a spontaneous reaction is always linked with the delta G that's being negative. So, is the delta G going to become more negative or more positive? You're becoming more negative and heading to spontaneous land. And that's the answer. How easy was that, guys, right? Let's box it off and call it a day. What'd you think? Hopefully this helped. Thank you for viewing the video. Subscribe to the channel and tell your friends, tell your classmates about this cool channel. My brother and I, we appreciate all of you so very much. And we're so happy to see how much this channel has reached out to people and, you know, how this channel is helping them out. So it's, it's great. Thank you so much. And I will be talking to you soon. Okay. Bye-bye.